I'm Anil Kumar and in this particular example we will solve height and distance problem using sine and cosine law. The question here is solve the triangle to find the height of flagpole. So let us say this is our flagpole FO and here let us say we have taken some measurements from point A and B. They are on the opposite side of flagpole angle of elevation is 85.6 here and from the other side it is 79.8 degrees and these two points are 100 meter apart and they are on the opposite side of the flagpole but collinear with the foot of the pole so there could be a word problem like this I have avoided typing all that but that is what it is okay now we need to find the height FO for this flagpole how are you going to find it one, you could always find tan ratios and do it, which is a lengthy method. Since we are doing chapter on trigonometry of acute angle, I am assuming that you know sine law, right? So we will use sine law to solve this particular question. I will also provide you with a link uh, so that you can also use trigonometric, primary trigonometric ratios to solve it, okay? It will be lengthier, but, but very important. Okay, sine law. To use sine law, I know this distance, I should know the angle opposite to it to solve it. Now that is known to me. I can say angle F is equals to 180 degrees. Take away these two angles. So we'll write this as 85.6 degrees. Take away 79.8 degrees. So that gives us 180 minus 85.6 minus 79.8 and that is equals to in decimals 14.6 okay 14.6 degrees so this is 14.6 since we know one ratio we can actually find all the sides so let's find any side let's see let's say find FB let's find this side FB so we can say FB so whenever I apply sine law I write the side which I want to find first so we'll find what is the length of FB so FB over angle opposite, which is sine of 85.6, should be equal to known side of 100 meters divided by sine of 14.6. Now cross multiply, so we get length FB is equals to 100 times sine of 85.6 divided by sine of 14.6, correct? Let's use the calculator. So, 100 times sine of 85.6 divided by sine of 14.6 equals to 0 0.25. 0 0.25. So, that is a very low value. Let me do, I might have done some calculations. Let's do it again. So, we have 100 times sine of 85.6 equals to divided by sine of 14.6 right so that gives us 395.395.54 okay so that is the value of fb for us so since we know FB, which is 395.54, we can find height using the angle and the right triangle here, correct? So height and, and the side are related with sine, correct? So let me write it down as sine of 79.8 degrees should be equal to height over hypotenuse. So height over 395.54 so height is equals to cross multiply 395.54 times sine of 79.8 so let's do it so we already have 395 we have 395.54 we'll multiply this by sine of 79.8 degrees that gives us 3 89.288 correct so we can round this answer to the nearest meter and write this as 389 meters 
So that is the height of this particular flagpole. So that is how you can actually solve such questions. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.